in terms of demographics, young, so young females are more addicted than boys when it comes to social media use. And that's why unfortunately it's becoming very, very common that uh, girls are also becoming very conscious of their looks, very kind of, um, what's what I'm looking for? Very, they have sometimes a negative perception about themselves, they feel an inadequate, they don't look beautiful enough, because let me tell you something, I don't know if you guys, obviously some of you must know, you should know, bloody hell, we're living in a zamana where everyone has a phone. You can airbrush your photos, you can photoshop them, you can make your face look different. So for example, you can take a picture, you can now suddenly widen the eyes, you can widen, you know, like, slimmer the face, make it more brighter, seem more, yeah, you, standard phones, standard phones you can do this. So what's happening is, a lot of people are, 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 a lot of girls especially, a lot more girls than boys, they take a lot of photos, and these are our daughters, our Muslim sisters, our Muslim mothers and aunties and so on, they take pictures, have you ever noticed how perfect people look in their pictures? You think, whoa, that's a great picture. Bruv, it's air, air shopped, airbrushed. Don't be fooling for the, for the gimmick. Subhanallah, there was a case where someone, he, he, he saw someone's profile picture, thought she was attractive. When he met her, he goes, hey, I'm not marrying that. I'm not marrying that. What she was presenting was something else. And anyway, this is just one example. There's hundreds and hundreds of examples. I, this is just one I read recently, so I'm just sharing it. But look, our girls, because some of them wear headscarves and so on, some of them do feel very unattractive. They feel ugly, they feel like they're stupid Because that's not what society makes them feel That's the vibe, isn't it? If you put a, a hijab on your head, you're forced Perhaps you're, you're coerced Your inferiority complex So to now feel that inferiority complex Then out comes the airbrush photos To kind of balance that Because when you have one extreme, you have the other but this is all born down to psychology, okay? When you feel that one side, then you go to another side to create an, create an equilibrium. If that makes sense, okay? If it doesn't, don't worry, just understand this much. Girls are more susceptible to becoming addicts and suffering from depression more likely than boys. And our young girls in our community, they're always seeking social validation. They're taking pictures with a smile, now whitening the teeth, whitening the, and waiting for those comments. And some of this boils down to how we interact with our sisters, our daughters, our mothers, and our aunts. Because unfortunately, coming from, and I'm, I'm going to say this, I'm going I'm to deliberately say it, from an Asian culture, boys are more prided and, than girls. Whether we want to admit and say, nini, walsa, nini, asa, no, it is like that. We have to be honest. And it's not just Asian, I'm telling you, there's a lot, of, a lot of places, okay? But I'm just saying, because obviously now, I, from my experience, this is more common... We have this barrier to show muhabbat and love between our, us and our children, more so daughters. Because sons are going to be ones who are going to provide for us when we get older. They're going to look after us. They're going to take care of the businesses and look after the family estates. The daughters are going to go into someone else's family and be else's, not ours. That's a really jahil mentality. That, that needs islah. Because then when you look at her as your daughter, she's your own flesh and blood. She, should, she deserves the exact haqq as your son. They are no different. But anyway, khair, that's another bayan, inshallah. But like I said, women, young girls, our young sisters, mothers, daughters, and so on, they are more susceptible. And they are more vulnerable to this. So we should go with a bit more of an open mind and understand that girls can also feel more vulnerable and just to take out some time for them. As fathers, brothers, sons, and so on, give them that affirmation. Tell them, mashallah, you know, you look really nice. You're not going hell for that. You're not going hell, brother. It's a good thing. It's a good thing to try and show some emotion sometimes. Because if you don't give that, well, have a guess what? She's going to go to TikTok to get it, YouTube to get it, Facebook, WhatsApp, Snapchat, Instagram, and everything else to get it. So, inshallah, let's try and understand these issues. Mm -hmm.